Good afternoon, everybody. Today we are looking at the Bengal, manufactured by Tiger Adventure Vehicles. This unit can be built on a Ford or a Chevy one-ton pickup truck chassis. This particular one is on an F-350 uh, extended cab. This unit was built with the optional flat platform across the back area. Now this area can either have the flat platform built into it or you can retain the back seat or just half of the back seat or we can put uh, a jump seat on either side. Moving inside the coach here. You see the kitchen and galley area straight ahead. Cabinets overhead for storage. All your panels for tank monitors and uh, solar inverters, etc., depending on the options of the rig. Got your microwave down below, your converter, and your furnace. And to the back of the coach, you've got a small wet bath, which we'll take a look at in just a minute. And the couch in the seating area, which actually is a jackknife sofa, uh, turns into a nice size bed. Ventilation fan, TV, LED lighting. Nice bunk over the cab. Take a look at this, some of the storage in here. This one has a, looks like a gas cooktop on it. Also do an electric one. AC DC refrigerator. Nice pantry or clothes closet area. Let's open up the bathroom here. This is a wet bath, so you've got a, a toilet and the sink and the shower head all combined in one area. Nice medicine cabinet for storing your toiletries and whatnot. Ventilation fan. Now this is the, the bed area, or the jackknife sofa, I should say. We'll remove this cushion. Gently set it aside. Got a couple of storage areas, additional storage right back here. And while we're doing storage some more, we've got storage here and a bunch of storage all the way all the way around. Okay. Oh, and your air conditioner. Okay. And now, remove these cushion, this other cushion. You start to see some of the systems down below here. Uh, looks like the solar converter is down there. You've got the water pump and underneath that carpeted box, that is the generator, uh, which is obviously mounted outside. Got your fresh water tank down below and your inverter and seat belts. And we will flip the sofa out with a jackknife. Makes a nice, nice additional sleeping space right there. And so we'll just do one more panoramic view here, the whole thing. sleeping area down 
Now with the cushions out of the way, there's still enough, plenty of space. I should have moved the cushions. Still plenty of space to walk up and access the restroom. And then like we were talking about at the beginning of the video, nice pass through area. Very easy to get into the truck cab. Visit us at tigervehicles.com or give us a call. We'd love to build a tiger for you.